As a race to the 2023 general election gears up, the need to enhance political participation among youths, women and persons with disabilities, especially in the formal spaces, have been stressed. The project lead at Stakeholders Development Network, SDN, in collaboration with the Independent National Electoral Commission and some on-air personalities are intensifying a continuous voter registration campaign in some communities in River State. Despite the signing of the Not Too Young to Run bill into law by President Muhammad Buhari on the 31st of May 2018, Nigeria's political space is still overtly dominated by the old generation and godfathers. They still determine who get what and favor their cronies to the detriment of many young Nigerians that are willing to participate in politics. To address this, the SDN is saying that youth need to be more involved in political parties, parliament, elections, civic spaces, and as a matter of right and part of solution to national challenges. At the sensitization campaign tagged Equal Niger, which is aimed at boosting voters' registration and turnout in the country, the project officer of SDN Flora Aseari emphasized that participation of youth, women, and persons with disabilities in the electoral processes is as important as participating in national development activities. It was saying that it is high time that women and young people, you know, youths, become a part of the system. So women and youth need to be in the process. When I mean in the process, they have to also belong to political parties. They also have to gain positions within the political party. So we want to see more youths, um, persons with disability, women, you know, we want to see them gain recognition by having, you know, positions in the political parties and representing the interests of that demographic. Representatives of INEC presence urged residents of the state who are yet to register or get their permanent voters' cards PVCs to use the opportunity of the ongoing continuous voter registration, CVR, to get registered. They also called on those who registered but abandoned their PVCs with INEC to endeavor to collect them. Some residents who spoke with newsmen said Nigerians must shun voting apathy and participate fully in elections so that the country's democracy can grow. I emphasize the importance of this continental voter registration. Okay, everyone has to come out in mass to register so that they will be able to exercise their civic responsibility come 2023. We started this right from my community, Rumo Kwachi, and today we are after Ozoba and uh, after Rumola here educating people to go out to go and get their PVC. Now, if you look at the statistics available in Nigeria, you would agree with me that um, the percentage of participation of youths is pretty much low. So we want to see that inclusivity, inclusivity, capturing more youths, capturing more women, capturing more people living with disability. The group urged Nigerians, especially the youth, not to only campaign on the social media, but participate actively in the electioneering process, as INEC does not conduct elections or count ballots on the social media. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.